How are you? I hope so. This is 2K GameX, and today I bring you another video from the Metro Exodus series. For those who don't know this game yet, I advise you to watch the video until the end. The game is incredible, with good dynamics, graphic storyline, and very versatile in the stages themselves. If you've stumbled across this video, leave your like and comment, and subscribe to the channel. If you're already subscribed, hit like and watch until the end. Without further ado, let's get to the game. And then Anna picked us up. Yes, Uncle Artem. Thank you. And your wife is great. She's kind and really strong. Thank you, Auntie Anna. There you go, Artyom. As I always Artyom, said. Artyom, stop by my desk once Artyom. you're done talking to me. Come over here, please. I've got something for you. Great job saving them, Artyom. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we're to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Miramak can't handle the repairs alone. So once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. And then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now, but still, so many questions. <sighs> there might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably get us in the key regions only. <sighs> in any case, we'll learn everything once we... We all locked out with Anna. She's a total... How do you like the backpack? No, Is it comfortable? Can you operate stealthily with it? We'd become unstoppable! I have a present for you, here! <laughs> A Tihar rifle. Ring any bells? It's pneumatic, but it still pecks a wallop. Plus, making bullets for it is easy as pie, even in the field. Just remember to keep that pressure up. Otherwise, you might as well be spitting him out yourself. Other than that, it will never fail you. I did my best. So, bear it with honor. <laughs> And don't forget to drop by from time to time. I have a few ideas for improving it. Katya, Nastya, come have some tea. Don't be shy. Thank you. Artyom, are you going to the port? I'm going to relieve Alyosha now, so I can't come with you. His hand is still giving him trouble. So Katya being a nurse is just perfect. It will make convincing Dad to take them along so much easier. I'm going to talk to him about that later. Besides, he doesn't really want to leave them here himself. I can see that. But he's so hung up on those occupying forces, he can't even think of anything else. All right, you go run that errand for my father now. Just be careful out there. You know I worry about you. So, Katya, where are you at from?
You pretty amazing, Bratuha. That was crazy. Blin, those mutants are pretty hardcore. The villagers I never have a chance against them. You? You just cut through them, Blin. Well, it's pleasure to meet you. Thanks, Chris, by the way. Of course, those dumb bastards. I've been here long enough to know the drill. They have a cult over there. The dumbasses are hung up on technology having destroyed the old world. So they don't exactly take kindly to smart guys here. And me, well, they were just gonna lock me up until I agreed to go fight those electrical demons of theirs to absolve my sins. Because I was in cahoots with Satan, apparently, blad. <laughs> Some Satanist I am. <laughs> I've been fixing engines and trading all my life. Now, now I'm moving to the east. Blin, I'm sick of this part of country. There's just nothing to do here anymore. The cities are gone. Bandits, beasts all around. Lots of space across the Volga, though. Plenty of opportunity. So, I came here with my rail car full of trading goods, hoping to make a few sales on the way east. What a fool I was. I was lucky to get out alive. <laughs> Anyway, since you've arrived, I've been thinking of this little plan I had, never had a chance to pull off alone, but since you guys are also going east... Now, judging by what I could see with my binoculars, it's a miracle your engine is still running. Oh, by the way, take the binoculars. I'll show you where everything is. Look at the bridge first. See that section on top? It should lower if the emergency mechanism still works. Katya from the church should know better. I've never been to the bridge myself. There, to the right. That huge hangar. That's a terminal bridge. The cult is considered a holy place. Covered it all in graffiti, schmafiti. There, tsarfish live there, you know. Stupid bastards. Even further right, see the building near all those carriages? Used to be a train depot. There are some bandits there now, but the place itself ain't bad. Oh, the area nearby isn't too bad either. There's a good hunting and stuff. I set up several safe camps around there. If you find them, you could rest, fix your equipment. <laughs> Unless you prefer spending nights at an open campfire. Now, come on, let me show you my home now.
Here is my cave. And this is where I live. Not a palace, well... Oh, here's a bed. So, if you're tired, my home is your home. I made a workbench to tinker on. If you need ammo, grenades, there's some uh, raw materials here. So, help yourself. You can have anything you like here. Can't carry on.
Artyom, I heard you call me. It was so great there. <coughs> but I heard you and couldn't leave you. It's good I can't find me. Oh, what is this place? See the barrels? They're chemicals of some kind. This place is either for storage or it's a dump. And that short could have been put there by the locals to mark the spot. Thank you, my love. Oh, okay. All right. So, uh, Arjun, let's pick her up now? No way in hell. I can... I can walk just fine. I'll just rest a bit and get going. <laughs> the old man's probably going seven sorts of crazy now, thinking his precious daughter got hurt or something. 
<clears throat> Dad, it's me. My radio battery died. I got it wet. Other than that, I'm fine. Artyom and the guys are here. back help Stepan persuade my father about letting Katya and Nastya travel with us <laughs> Artyom I am feeling better now really I am so Sam tell me what the real enemy bases look like so that we know when when we see it well first of all there are these huge humanoid robots all plastered with stars and stripes with nuclear reactors up their asses. Oh, and the food's great. Burgers, fries, shakes. I'm being serious. What the hell? Okay, well, let me be serious, too. How the hell am I supposed to know how they look now? I haven't seen one in, what, 20 years or so? A fence, some guard towers, patrols, buildings. Bases look like bases. Nothing like that around here. We have yet to see anything even remotely resembling one. But if we do, I'll be sure to go say hi. If I can still remember how to speak English. Uh, uh, all right. D don't be mad. Do you guys really believe you're going to see any Americans here? I was hesitant at first, but now I think I'm the only American we're ever going to see out here. <laughs> well, that's fine by me, since we can always talk things out with Friends, that's all for today. I'd like to thank those who followed us to the end. If you're new, subscribe to the channel, activate the bell, leave your like, and comment on the video. If you liked it, which game you want me to bring to the channel, feel free to comment. Once again, I would like to thank you all for watching the video. Until next time, bye.